Hey kings and queens, welcome back to the castle. It's your girl, Queen Shirls here, and if you are new, welcome to the castle. Or welcome to my car, because that's where we're at. <laughs> just came from Starbucks. I just left my home. But let me show y'all what I got. It's a new drink I got it from TikTok. It's a venti vanilla cream cold brew, five pumps of caramel syrup and vanilla. On the TikTok, it didn't have the vanilla, but then the girl was like, do you wanna add the vanilla that comes with it? And I was just like, sure. I mean, I like vanilla, so why not? So we're gonna try it, this is it. It was $4.35, I believe. It was very cheap for a venti, so let's try. It's not bad. Let me put this in it because. Ooh, so I can get the full effect. Maybe. Mix it up a little bit. How you guys doing on this fine Tuesday morning? I am doing great. Yeah. That's pretty good. Mm hmm. This is like drinkable. I mean, it's not like really sweet, you know? Like it's not crazy sweet. And usually I like that shit. <laughs> but this is, it's not that bad. Like I could fucking drink this shit. Damn, my language is just <laughs> off the rocket. Yeah, this is really good. I'm gonna be sipping on that. And now we're gonna go to our spot to do my mother fucking makeup. I'm so in love I'm trying to find like the best lighting possible. But I don't know. Like I don't think this is bad, but was it good? <laughs> I have arrived at my destination. I am literally on top of the roof at the mall. And I'm gonna be doing my makeup. Girl and boys. <laughs> we got a lot, a lot to talk about. Like I got a whole bunch of tea that I'm ready to spill to y'all. My wig cap is showing. <laughs> I don't know. Is this lighting good, guys? Is this is this better? Cause I feel like is that better? I don't know. Can y'all see me? No. Yes. Whatever. That's fine. Okay. Let's get started. This is literally just gonna be a very simple, quick makeup that I do when I have my bangs on, just because like this half of my face doesn't need the makeup like I don't need my eyebrows or anything done so I just need this bottom half done oh why do I I just felt this car shake and I don't think we got earthquakes in Florida so I'm just gonna put... whoa put a little too much but we're gonna put the primer <laughs> on the bottom half of my face <clears throat> okay first things first i'm the realist what should i tell y'all first well i guess i should tell y'all that i got a new car <laughs> i am in my new vehicle her name is diamond and she's literally my pride and joy my greatest accomplishment <laughs> and i love her so much i got her in august so i've had her about like a month or two where the fuck is my shit oh here it is i've had her for you know a month or two and she's just been really she's been whoa i can't speak <laughs> let's try again skirt 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 she has just been treating me right you know but like low key <laughs> Um, a couple weeks ago, I was driving home at night, 
and you know after the club and stuff and um this mailbox it was either a mailbox or a trash can i don't i don't remember but this mailbox or trash can came out of fucking nowhere and like attacked my shit <laughs> like literally attacked the fuck out of diamond so my um side mirror on my left side had broken off like i just saw a piece of her on the ground and it was the saddest thing that has ever happened to me that's a lie but it was it was pretty up there on the top saddest things that has happened to me just because like she's so new and fresh and just so precious that this fucking mailbox or trash can just disrespected her like for real like hang on hang on hang on do that to my baby girl but it's okay. I got her fixed. And guess how much it was, guys? Guess, guess, guess. Is that your final answer? $321 fucking dollars, bitch. Yup. Yup. $321. For what? Like, for what? And you did this for what? I thought it was going to be like $100, $150 at least, you know? But no, that shit was $321. And I was just like, wow, what the fuck? Y'all tried my shit. Honestly, I can't walk the time. Like, I'm just talking to y'all. I'm not doing my makeup. But um, yeah, so that's the tea on that. Oh, I'm looking kind of better now. The sun's like out or down. Ooh, what you guys think? Yes? No? Ooh, it's coming back up. But, um... Let me use this, too. Can y'all see me? So, I just use this, and then I, like, hide up my dark spots. Because your bitch got a lot of those shits. Unfortunately. Oh, that's another thing. Like, I'm trying so many, like, remedies and stuff on how to take away my dark spots. So, like, I've tried the turmeric um, scrub. I've started trying this potato scrub thing. On. I saw all these shits on TikTok. I don't know if it's working. Like, I just started the turmeric one, like, three weeks ago. And I'm not seeing a difference yet. And I started the potato one, like, yesterday. <laughs> So, I don't know. If y'all know any, like, remedies or little masks or face masks that y'all know that helps cure, like, dark spots and, like, acne and stuff, let me know. Let a bitch know because I just want clear skin. I mean, at this point, I've had it. I've been dealing with this all my life, so I'm, like, used to it. <laughs> I'm just like, whatever, it's fine. But... If they could like slowly but surely get away then that would be appreciated so comment down below if you guys have any tips tricks because the bitch is struggling out here how do i look girls and boy i don't know who watches my channel like i don't know the majority of like if it's majorly majorly ma <laughs> how the fuck do you say that word if it's majorly major majorly majorly if it's majorly if it's majorly, 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 if it's majorly girls, majorly, that don't sound right. If it's majorly, what the fuck? Who knows what I'm trying to say? How the fuck do you say that shit? If it's majorly, majorly, I don't know, majorly? Is it majorly? I don't know. If it's mostly, is it mostly? <laughs> If it's mostly girls or boys who watch my um, my channel. Honestly, nobody watches my channel now because I just stopped posting. But your girl is back, baby. <laughs> Even though, like, I always fucking... Oh, I forgot my... My mist. My setting spray. This is gonna apply so, like, badly, I feel like. Just because I, like, wet, wet. So I don't know if it's gonna spread 
good. Another thing that's happened with me, y'all, is I started working at Hooters. Hooters. And um, I had started working in August. And um, I was excited about it, you know? I was like, I've never been a server before. Ooh, this lighting. It's so dark. But can y'all see me still? <laughs> yeah, I started working at Hooters and I was excited mainly like to wear the uniforms and stuff. It's cute as fuck. And I've never served before, so that was gonna be like a challenge, but like I was ready for the challenge. And so, you know, I was working. I was still like in a modified section, you know? So basically that's like a section that only has like three tables. Like it's the same section every time, like my shift. And I was only working in the mornings, three days. This was like for two months. And like in the mornings, it's not busy at all. So like I basically only had like two tables at a time, you know? Like I got the hang of it, like the menu and stuff and like all that. It's just I didn't get the hang of it when it's like super duper busy because my boss never fucking scheduled me like act a one night shift. Never scheduled me, you know, one busy Friday night shift or something, you know, where it's like, okay, let's get you some practice. Because me, I'm like a hands-on type of bitch, you know? Hands-on with like everything. Like that's how I learn. How is if I can learn the the ropes, how to do it and shit? If if you schedule me in the mornings, it's not busy at all. It's slow as heck. How am I supposed to get the use the hang of it? How am I supposed to get used to shit? How 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 am I supposed to, you know, get my groove? So then on a Tuesday morning, it was kind of, it was like really busy. For me, it was busy <laughs> because one, you know, I never experienced like having more than like four tables, like having four tables at a time, like I never experienced that. And at this time on Tuesday, last Tuesday, he, I wasn't in a modified shift. So I had four tables and one of those tables sat nine people. <laughs> And of course, <laughs> I, you know, had that section that had nine people. So, um, yeah, on Tuesday, I was really busy and I just, I just wasn't prepared because <laughs> I was expecting it to be like a slow fucking day per usual, right? And no, it was just full of people for some reason on a Tuesday. And then my boss was there and he was like kind of being stern with me like Shirley come here like go get their drinks go bring up their food yada 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 and I'm just like hold on damn where the fuck is my set oh here it is <laughs> I'm just like hold on damn shit oh this is gonna get everywhere huh get in my setting powder let me open it outside after the rush was done I already know like <laughs> I was not giving some people the attention that they deserved you know like it was just a hot mess and after like the rush was done I talked to my boss and I was like wow that was kind of crazy and he was like not really and I'm like I'm like, okay, well, for me, it was kind of crazy because I wasn't, like, used to it and stuff. Like, I've always only had, like, two tables at a time. And then he was, like, three. And I'm like, no, nigga. I've had two tables because it wasn't fucking busy because you scheduled me in the fucking morning. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> but, of course, I didn't say that. I was just like, well, no, because... It's never busy when I work, you know, like I've always only had like two tables at a time. And he was like, well, you know, it's it's that uh, second gear I was talking about. Basically, this nigga thinks I'm fucking slow at my job. Like, there's no reason for me to be, um, to be putting in second, ooh, the lighting's back. <laughs> I'm like thinking there's no reason for me to put it in second gear because I only have two tables at a time. 
like I bring out their food I take their order I get their drinks in a timely manner I don't know what second gear this nigga is talking about when I only have two fucking tables at a motherfucking time so yeah I was kind of over it you know <laughs> that like the boss he was kind of like he was kind of like rude and like mean like he he just didn't I don't know I don't know what why he was like that but he was just like whenever I would like mess up like when I first started he would always like I'll be like hey can you like cancel this order because you need to can you need a manager's card for like everything basically like it's so fucking annoying and so I was like hey can you cancel this and he, he this is him <laughs> All right, I'd be like, hey, um, can you cancel this? Like, I accidentally, or I actually didn't play this on, and whatever, yada, yada, yada. This boy, this man goes, okay, meet me over there. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, he would always be like, oh, like, my nigga, this is, this is your job. Like, you're supposed to be willing and open to like help you know what i mean instead of just rolling your eyes and being like okay go like literally okay go over there like excuse you sir i am new okay show me some respect <laughs> yeah honestly like if you're a manager or like a general manager of any place how you treat your employees fucking matters because because um that sets the whole mood of the workplace you know what i mean and like when other managers would be opening or would work instead of him like the vibe was just so great like everybody was happy like people weren't stepping on their tippy toes you know what i mean like it was just good vibes all around but um yeah and i basically only worked with him the mean guy because he worked when i worked monday through wednesday and it was just not a good time i mean it was a good it was okay it was it was an okay time you know i wasn't like oh my gosh yes let's go to work you know i was like fuck like i gotta go to fucking work the next day i was supposed to work and i just i just didn't i just didn't show up y'all like i was like fuck this i didn't show up um no call no show <laughs> and yeah so i i left hooters and i feel good <laughs> like it's it was the best decision that i could make because i don't think i meant to work <laughs> you know and I told my sister this, my older sister, I was like, yeah, Bercy, I don't think I'm meant to work. And she's like, well, nobody really wants to work, but they have to work. And I'm just like, we don't have to work, okay? We choose to work. <laughs> but, you know, I just didn't like the feeling it was giving me, you know? And I gotta, I gotta take care of my mind and my soul. Like, if I don't like the environment that I'm in, I, girl, baby girl, I gotta do something about it. Like, obviously, I can't, the manager is not gonna leave. Obviously. So, I had to leave. <laughs> so, I fucking left. I don't have any lipstick, but whatever, that's fine, right? This is the final look. Can you guys see? Cute, right? I shouldn't have, who the fuck? Did I post? Oh, yeah, I did post something. Y'all ever like post something on Snapchat and then you forget you post something on Snapchat and you get all these like notifications from Snapchat and you're just like, what the fuck? Did I post something on Snapchat? But then you're like, oh shit, I did post something on Snapchat. That was me 10 seconds ago. <laughs> but yeah, I should have gotten like a, vent or, um, a grande because this is a lot. I'm still drink it though. Oh yeah, guys, that was kind of the tea on my life. Just a little bit, a little snippet of my life. Um, nothing too crazy. 
Halloween's coming up, y'all, and I'm excited for Halloween. I'm gonna be an angel. I'm gonna be posting a Halloween video on the 31st. I'm gonna be an angel, a sexy angel. My costume already came in. I'm so excited. There's not really any parties going on. Well, there might be. I just wasn't invited to them. <laughs> this girl, she was like, hey, what are you doing for Halloween? And I was like, well, I don't know, probably like the club or something. And then she was like, well, I was thinking of going to for Myers in like society, get VIP. And I'm like, oh, VIP? We rolling in VIP? Okay, sis. Okay, okay. I don't really know her like that, but <laughs> if we get into VIP, baby girl, I'm there. I'm there. Yes, sign me up. That's all I got for ya. Thank you so much for watching my video. I will check back with you guys soon. I have some things up my sleeve that I wanna film for y'all since I'm unemployed and I ain't got nothing else to do. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I ramble on too much. I need to chill, I need to chill. Why? Oh shit. Did I really, is there a 12 behind me right now? Y'all see him? I know y'all see him, right? Why does this always happen to me? What the fuck is this nigga doing? Hello. Hi. Yes. How are you? Good. How are you? Huh? Am I alright? Am I alright? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> are you alright? Oh yeah, everything's good. Well, you fight like that. I had to get the sunlight. The sunlight? <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Just chilling. Just chilling? Yeah. You wanna park a little bit there? Oh yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, I'll do that. Did you? Yeah, I could. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, officer. Uh, <laughs> Bye. Drive safe. <laughs> Y'all saw that, right? <laughs> Man, my hair looks a fucking mess. But at that note, I gotta, I gotta get out of here. I mean, I don't have to get out of here, but I just have to move my car up a little bit more because I parked a little crazy. But thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.